the papyrus. Put it on my table every month. I don't wanna miss the it. Welcome to the Papyrus TV Africa and this is an update on musician Maud Bad's death. Since the mysterious passing of Maud a lot of people have come up with different versions. However, according to the man who was present at the hospital, the lead singer Maud was taken to before his death. The nurses and the friends that brought him in acted suspiciously. According to a viral voice of the man now circulating on all social media, he claimed he took picture with the lead singer and noticed he wasn't looking quite himself. He said Mobad was brought into the hospital conscious by a friend who announced his death while crying on social media. The man said one of the nurses whispered to him that the lead singer was injected with a substance before passing out. He then advised that questions have to be asked and arrest made. So like I was saying, I was at the hospital that morning when Mubad arrived. He came with one guy, the same guy that his video was trending on social media that was shouting, Mubad is dead, Mubad is dead. And that's why I told you that that guy, he had a lot of questions to answer because he know a lot of things that Nigerians don't know. The same guy he came with and he is the same guy that took him out of hospital. Now I was at the hospital that morning when he arrived and I even took a picture with him. I will send you the picture. I will send you the picture. So when he came, I was I was happy to see him. I I requested if I can take a picture with him, and he said no problem. Though I noticed he he looked so down, he was looking so uh, down that morning. I was not happy initially because they gave me appointment, uh, um, and I got there. Uh, I stayed there for almost an hour. They told me that the doctor is not around. So at the time, I got angry, and one of the nurses there came to like calm me down that the doctor will soon arrive. So while we are talking. Mobad came in with the guy. So I saw him and instantly I was lightened up and I was like, ah, Mobad, I used to listen to your song. I'm one of your fans. Can I please take a picture with you? And he said, okay, no problem. So after taking this picture with him, he went inside. He went inside and I was sitting down at the reception there. I was just looking at the picture. Then after 20 minutes, after 15 to 20 minutes that he went inside, started noticing that. They were just moving around. A lot of confusion. I couldn't understand. I noticed that they were trying to make call. They were trying to call some, some people. The nurses, they were just walking around. And something was not just right. So I have to like stand up. I needed to ask someone like what's going on because at the time I was even like, ang like I was even like kind of afraid uh, if I'm safe there. So I have to like, uh, I saw the nurse that was trying to like calm me down earlier. So I called her and I was like, ah, what happened? She whispered to my ear that they gave Mobad injection and he collapsed. So I was, I was shocked. Mobad, I wanted to shout. Before I know, even the nurse I was, because I wanted to like ask her, ah, what happened? Before I know, she left me. So I was kind of confused. In that confused state, I was just standing around. Before I know, before I know, before my own very eyes, this same guy that came with a, a Mobad a, rushed him out of the out of the hospital, shirtless, out of the hospital, and the whole everything just happened just happened so fast. A, it, normally, okay, you gave a patient a, a, a an injection. And he passed out. At least the hospital will do something or try something to at least try to resuscitate him or try to do something. Even if he passed out or maybe he's confirmed dead, he's finally confirmed dead. Maybe the hospital will, will even be the one to even arrange properly to even take him to mortuary or so. But the guy with some, with, uh, some nurses, they were the one that rushed this guy out horribly in my presence. And I was so confused. I was like... What is going on? I tried to ask questions. Nobody answered me. And at the time, I didn't even. I later did not even take my. Uh, I later did not even take my injection that I went there to to take. So, <laughs> God, oh God, oh God, oh, this life. 
Es no te eres la naturaleza, no te eres la This is so what I saw. I saw him in my own eyes that morning. I saw him. I saw him. I took a picture with him. I saw him. I saw him. I saw him. This is why this thing is paining me. What lie? What lie? It's like, what? Before I know, I was still at the hospital. I was still at the hospital. I was still at the hospital when I heard the news that he was dead. I was like, so quick. These people did not even try to do anything safe. They did not even, in fact, these people, they did not even, they did not try at all to help this guy. Like, it was deliberate attempt. <laughs> in another development, Mobad younger brother has come to clear the air on why his brother was buried just a few hours after his passing. A video of a young man claiming to be late singer Mobad's brother is trending on social media currently. In the video, the young man gave a reason Mobad next was bent in his casket before he was buried. The young man claimed their father said the casket used in burying the singer was not his size. The viral video, the unidentified young man who claims he was connected to the disease and proceeded to clear the air on the controversy surrounding Mobad's barrier. The young man claimed his father allegedly gave someone money to buy a gasket, but he didn't purchase the right size. His words, Hello guys, I am Mobad's brother. I have been seeing many comments on social media asking why was his neck bent. Actually, my dad gave someone money to buy a gasket and he didn't buy the right size. So we just buried him like that. Hello guys, I'm Mobad uh, brother. So I have been seeing many comments on the social media saying why why is his neck bent. Actually, my dad gave someone money to buy a casket and, and I think he didn't buy the right size. That's why we just buried him like that. We just buried him like that why the rush this has been the papyrus tv africa the papyrus put it on my table every month i don't